Hello mates, welcome back to my channel. Today I have made the Tiki from SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom rehydrated in Minecraft. Yes, that is what I have made today. I have made the Tiki from the video game SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom rehydrated in Minecraft today. This Tiki is the regular Tiki the wooden one, the one that you break with no problem. <laughs> uh, yes, uh, this is the one that you break with no problem. Pretty easy to do. And uh, yeah, this is the wooden one. Don't look to your left. Don't look at that one. That's not important. This one is the one we're looking at. This one is. And uh, yeah, me. So um, yeah, I want to do everything from. The video game SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom rehydrated in Minecraft, and you see the scale is much more different than the you know the other builds I did. The houses, of course, I wanted to do more detail and have a good detail of it. I'm gonna show you everything that I could do um, in it. There's some things I could work on, yes, but um, I think it's look pretty good. And yeah, of course the score is not there to the you know to the other houses. This is so much smaller, but if I make it small, you can't see the detail. So let's see how I do this right now. So let's go. So mates, the first thing I do of course is making the outline. Um there's a little bit of uh, different things, right? Uh, I usually go top to bottom. And yeah, um yeah that's pretty much it. This one I uh, do do the scale, not the scale, the outline. But I wanted to make sure I get the teeth right. Um I got it wrong actually <laughs> um there's supposed to be six teeth in the front and i think two in the back or two in the sides i made seven <laughs> and two in the sides that was right but i made seven by accident i don't know why but i made seven but it still looked good uh, um and yeah there's different there's different things um wood is different right um I do want to make sure I get the wood correctly, and it's a bit different. Um, all the wood is going up, not to the side. So I have to uh, redo some things to make sure it is going up, right? And I really like doing these projects, especially the project that really make me use other things. I usually use, I usually use materials that is concrete. <laughs> Concrete is the only thing that I use for such a long time, but making these new projects or different projects or making something new with, with these projects is um, really cool. I really am able to use different um, materials and really think that that really um, evolve my you know creative side. And I really haven't used wood as much as I did um, when I was making these. I usually use wood for like the door and that's it. I really don't really use wood, only concrete. But now not only I'm just using wood, I'm using all type of wood. Even uh, strip wood, right, you, um, right, using not just planks. I usually use planks, like now I'm using just actual the wood, the wood logs and the uh, uh, strip wood, right, and different colors of wood too. And I really like doing those because it really made me use different type of materials. I'm using a lot more wood and not just wood, other materials. I'm using other materials than just like for the ground to as well, different materials for the ground. There's many different things that I could use for dirt that I really didn't think of. And using the texture to as well really set some things really good to as well. And not just using the color to make it look like it but using the texture to as well. It's really cool. And yeah the tiki is um isn't it's pretty I don't know, there's a lot of details into this I would say. Um and yeah there's a lot of details into this and yes it may be short in the video game. You could jump over it, yes. I think it, uh well it's really small. <laughs> It's a lot smaller than the houses, yes. The SpongeBob houses is bigger. Even Patrick house is bigger than uh, these tiki's. But there's actually a lot of detail into them. 
there is a lot of detail um that I that I didn't well I knew about it but I um I didn't know it was a lot more detail than than it looks like. Right do not only it have some different colours, different textures, but of course you got the eyes, the mouth. You can't do this, you can't do those in like four blocks. You really can't. You really can't do the detail that you that it has if you put it really small into at the actual scale. You wanna do the actual scale, you have to make it seem much way much more bigger. The Patrick House has to be bigger. Squidward House Spongebob House has to be a lot more bigger. And even this one has to be bigger too. Making everything to scale. That's why I'm just really focusing on just making making it then really putting it to scale. I'm gonna make everything force then maybe if I really want to put it to scale because there's some things that you really just can't put to scale like this one want all the details you really can't and you're gonna put you know the tiki's into into your world with the scale you probably have to do one block of wood or stone and then there you go <laughs> but um yeah, I really want to make sure I have all the details that it has, and and that it does have, and, and um, I really want to make sure that I do it as uh, as good as I can. And I did pretty good on it. Yes, there's some things I could work on, but I did do pretty good. And I do want to um, I do want to do everything, including some other small things, maybe small, but the detail will have, of course, is gonna be is different, and um, and yeah. And um, yeah, I'm planning to do most everything in the um, in the video game SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. I am want to do everything, so um, yes. And it is gonna be different, of course. Uh, maybe we have the same buildings, of course. Maybe even new buildings that I haven't done yet. And if it is the same buildings, I should, we will try to do it as different as I can to the one I would have done of course Patrick, Spongebob and Scooter Houses is different um it's different compared to the um what I did before these ones was a bit more different it's more closely go for the um the video game compared to the other one it just it's right there right <laughs> um and yeah I do like um the bottle for bikini bottom rehydrated um, you know, look of the look of it. It's much more brighter compared to the. Um, it is much more brighter. There's something that's much more dark that really bring out the brightness in some houses, like like um like a Squidward house is dark, right? It's dark blue, and um. Uh, SpongeBob house is bright orange. We have some, you know, has some dark colors that go against the white, uh, the uh, light colors, right? The light colors of the orange really bring out that orange. And using the um, using a dark color with the bright color really show the uh, bright color, and really and really does um, show the bright colors of it. I really haven't talked about this. <laughs> um, wow. Well, um, I made the outline. They make the body. Add the uh, eyes, the mouth, the nose at the top, and there we go. Yeah, there we go, mates. Oh, I mean, so there you have it. That is the uh, Tiki from SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom. We had traded in Minecraft. I will say that I am very sorry. I actually didn't go over it. Uh, it's pretty simple. The base of it is white concrete. Then you make the body. You go for you make the body of it, the actual, not the body of it, but you know, the wooden parts, and use the uh, then use the teeth to go a bit more up, and then make the nose, then the eyes, then everything else go fill up. Um, I really use I use I usually go from the front to the back. I'm making something with a lot of detail into it like this one and yeah mates thank you mates for watching this video there is a playlist of uh, spongebob builds that I make 
please check out the playlist. I'll see you in the next time. Bye.